Imagine this, a voice that has echoed throughout the ages, unwavering and unrelenting. Do not do that. I am a fellow servant with you and your brothers the prophets, and with those who keep the words of this book. Worship God. A powerful decree, isn't it? This message, unsealed unhidden, was shared with an urgency, a pressing need. Do not seal up the words of prophecy in this book because the time is near. In the face of such a prophecy, what does one do? Simply, continue. Let the unrighteous continue to be unrighteous, and the vile continue to be vile. Let the righteous continue to practice righteousness and the holy continue to be holy. These words from Revelation 22 verses 9 to 11 remind us of an impending truth. Jesus is coming. And in this truth, we find our call to action. Remain steadfast. Remain true. For in the end, it is not our actions that will define us, but our hearts.